Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm just turning on the light. If you are new, thank you. Thank you so much for joining me. And if you're returning, well, welcome back. <laughs> so today, actually the next two days is going to be filled full of some deep cleaning motivation in my house. It's just been a wreck. I'm going to show you in a minute. And then we're going to get some massive deep cleaning done. This is going to be a two day clean with me. And so you're going to get tons of cleaning motivation. We're going to clean the couches, clean the carpets, clean every room in my house and just, yeah, get laundry done and just get it all set up and ready. Um, I'm so excited. I have four days off this week. Um, two of them are paid. So, um, it actually works out cause I can spend two days filming this, um, a day with my husband and a day with my son. So, um, it really works out. Um, but if you are new here and you don't know, both my husband and I have, um, 40 hour jobs. Um, so we both work full time and I do YouTube on the side. I love to clean and, um, yeah, so I thought I would just, you know, take what I love and use it and film it and give someone else cleaning motivation. So we're just gonna, walking through my house. So, um, today is going to be, um, really interesting. Um, I will have to stop filming and take my son to school. So you'll probably see him pop in and out of the frame a little bit. I'm about to go wake him up here in a minute. And then, um, I'll have to take him to school, but I'm going to clean before that. And I'm going to clean after that. So yeah. So just hold on just a minute and I'm going to show you what my house looks like. Okay. Okay, so this is my kitchen. Um, not really too bad because I cleaned it up uh, last night. That's my coffee mess over there. Not too bad because I did clean up after dinner last night. But I do got to clean out my fridge. See, that's my fridge. <laughs> I got to clean it out and get all the leftovers out of there. And yeah, clean out. Focus to save my life. See, right down there. See, see, my fridge is disgusting. Okay, and the outside of my fridge is disgusting too. See all the fingerprints and crap. Anyway, then that's my trash I gotta take out. It's my vacuum, my living room. It's my coffee from this morning. Just a mess. I gotta clean the couches because they got chocolate all over my couches and I was not happy. Laundry. Corner of the foyer. Laundry's going. Say hi, my my. Hi, Miles. Say Miles, say hi. And then my bedroom, which is completely ripped apart because I'm washing the blankets right now. That is my bedroom, my dresser, yeah, my bedroom's a disaster. Then my, hi, my bathroom. I just got ready, so it's a mess. And we're gonna clean it all up. All right, <sighs> we'll be around. So, yeah, we're gonna, I'm gonna put you on the tripod and we're gonna get into this today. Um, I would show you the rest of the house, but my son is sleeping and we are gonna do his room and his bathroom, but he's sleeping right now and I'm about to wake him up. But, so yeah, we're just gonna get into this.
everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm so happy that you all could join me. Um, I hope everyone is having a wonderful start to the 2022 new year and I hope all of your guys' dreams and New Year's resolutions are coming true. Um, so yeah, we're going to get into today's video. Um, I am starting in my master bath and we're going to get my master bath clean. Um, this video well it took me two days it's a two-day clean with me but it's going to be a two video upload because the first video that I'm editing right now is just under an hour long and I still have the last half of my house to edit so my son's room bathroom foyer all that so these videos are gonna be kind of long um, I hope you guys don't mind um, if you like long videos um, give me a thumbs up and and like the video if you don't just leave a comment and I'll try to make shorter ones but this I got so much cleaning done so if you need cleaning motivation it is here I mean I got so I was just so like just surprised how much I got done but um so yeah so in this video we're gonna be cleaning my whole house and um hope you guys enjoy and let's get back into it
did change my shirt in case you're wondering this is not day two this is still day one I just had to change my shirt but I got really frustrated with myself because I got bleach all over it and it's not the first time I've ruined a shirt getting bleach all over it I use bleach in my bathrooms because I've always been that way I just feel like it gets cleaner I use it in my tub and my toilet and everything um, and also in this video you're gonna like see videos parts of the video where it just cuts off um, for some reason when I film my camera can't write to my um, SD card fast enough so it just stops and I googled it and I need to get a different SD card I just haven't had a chance but I'm gonna try to edit it as best as I can this is the longest video I've had to edit to date and I am definitely learning a lot um, so um, obviously it gets better with time practice makes perfect but I hope you guys really like this video um, and uh, also while I was cleaning my bathroom my toilet got clogged and so I had to stop filming and figure out how to unclog it and I did get it unclogged um, but yeah so uh, let's get back into this <laughs>
So here I am literally just going through all my mail. Um, who else keeps a copy of their bills even after they're paid? Because I do and I had so many bills from previous months. Of course they were already paid but I just kept the bill. Like I thought I went green you know where they don't send you a paper notice but I don't know maybe I didn't but I just had I had so many I had to throw away like well I shredded them and then threw them away but I mean you know who else is into just keeping whatever but yeah here I am just cleaning off my desk this is where obviously I do my um uh, financing my finances and um edit my youtube videos and all that and getting my desk cleaned up so yeah this could be the summer of our lives the summer So I'm going to kind of take a poll here. Um, if you guys just like solid cleaning videos, um, let me know in my comments. I've been seeing a lot of stuff on YouTube lately, um, drama and stuff um, concerning um, like family vlog channels and, and all that. Um, mine is just a straight solid cleaning channel. My husband and my son are not in my videos. You might see like them cross through the frame every once in a while, but, for the, but they are not in my videos. Um, but if you um, get bored with me just cleaning the same rooms every time, um, let me know. I can try to change it up a little bit, do some cooking and cleaning. Um, I am getting back to my roots in cooking. I did go, go to culinary school years and years and years ago, and now I'm trying to get back into um, cooking like I used to, and so I can definitely do that. But yeah, just let me know in the comments. Um, I hope that I am providing motivation. I love to clean. I love the end result after cleaning. Cleaning just decompresses me and makes me feel good and just helps me um, get through uh, a tough week um, because I do have a 40 hour job in retail. So um, yeah, just let me know if you guys just like, um, you know, straight cleaning videos. And if there's anything specific you guys would like to see, um, I can definitely try to um, put that into my videos. Here I am cleaning the carpets in my room. They needed it so bad. Um, so yeah, so, and now we're gonna move on to the living room. And um, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. Not like anything we've done before, oh, oh, yeah Now it's time for something better And time for us to follow our dreams No, we can't stay no more, oh Come run away Don't be afraid Better and time for. 
for us to follow our dreams No, we can't stay no more Growing up, 
up, said we'd be on forever. You taught me how to love, and nothing could be better than you and me, you and me, baby. It was you and me. We can never fall, but nobody could break us here. I thought we had it all. Take me back to when it was you and me, you and me, baby. It was you and me.
Why do I feel like breaking rules on the edge? Looking out with no parachute. You know I'm dreaming about us too. Playing around without a clue on the edge. Screening out. With us, it's all or nothing. So a perfect example of what I was talking about um, when I said my video just, my camera just stops. Um, you missed me wiping down my kitchen table because my camera had just stopped recording and it didn't, <laughs> I didn't realize it. But here I am cleaning up my fridge. Sometimes I feel like my fridge is not big enough, but I'm going to clean it out. And then it's going to look kind of empty, but we do end up going grocery shopping. Um, this week um, was a big haul and I wish I would have done it, but... I forgot to film it, but we spent like almost $300 on groceries. Um, we shop every two to three weeks um, because it just works out better for us. There's only three of us. And so planning out that far ahead is actually a lot easier than just doing it on a week by week basis. Um, so yeah, so we did a big haul and now I'm just cleaning the shelves and getting things out of my fridge that are expired and rotten <laughs> um so yeah so that's what i'm doing here i'll meet you outside away from the crowd just you and me together we'll all sing there outside just us in the sky i will go wherever i'll be honest
Feels like a heavy burden But I can't relate Do our actions even matter? Or is this a fate? At least now I'm feeling better I know I'm here to stay Won't you come outside Where the sunflowers bloom It was a Saturday night Remember seeing you just dancing in the middle of the crowd There was something about you cause you got stuck in my mind Stuck in my mind, stuck in my mind I thought I'd give it a go and I started talking to you I don't know what I said but the next thing I knew Is that I held you in my arms and you asked what we should do What should we do? What should we do? I said you can do what you want to with me Yeah, I won't mind as long as you stay with me, I'm alright. I wanna hold ya. I wanna hold ya. You got those red lips, blue eyes, black skinny jeans, and every room you walk into, you're always setting the scene. I wanna. Club and we started walking the streets And then we stopped for a while And you said you wanna kiss me I remember thinking Is this really happening? Happening, happening I never thought I'd meet someone so beautiful I couldn't quite believe it It was magical Just kissing on the street lights On our way back home Our way back home Our way back home I said you can do what you want to with me Yeah, I won't mind as long as you stay with me, I'm alright I wanna hold ya So here I am making my bed while I was cleaning my my house. My bedding was washing and drying. Um, I do do laundry in the background when I am filming. I don't always show me switching it out and everything, but um, it needed to be washed. So uh, by the time I was done with the kitchen, um, my bedding was done. So I thought that you know I would show you kind of the the routine it goes throughout the day. Um, I could have switched this clip around to back when I was cleaning the bedroom, but I just kind of want to show you real life and transparency that, um, you know, sometimes laundry isn't done until way later in the afternoon because my washer and dryer have long cycles. But yeah, here I'm just going to make my bed and then we're going to get back um, into cleaning. And if you've made it this far, thank you, thank you, thank you so much because the video is almost over. Um, so uh, let me know um, if you liked it. And I think this will probably be the last time that I will probably talk in video one. So I hope you guys all have a great 2022. And I will see everyone in the next video.
I'm so lonely. I think I'm crazy. Well, well, well. It is day two of cleaning, but I'm gonna show you guys something because it is so cold outside. So we're gonna step outside my front door for a minute. I'm gonna turn you guys around. Okay. So. Okay. So that is what it looks like right now. So it snowed a little bit. That. Look at all that ice. Like, do you see that? That's where I slid packing out of my driveway. But yeah, all that is ice. Oh my God. It is just so cold, but it is so crisp and just, yeah. So yeah, it's like 11 degrees. So um, we are starting the back of the house now. I'll turn on the lights so we have better lighting here. And so we're gonna do my son's room, my son's bathroom slash guest, guest bathroom and the foyer. And yeah, so I started by stripping his bed, putting his blankets in this morning so I can get a head start on those. And then I take him to school. Yeah, he went to school today. It's 11 degrees outside, but it's okay. Totally used to it. So anyway, but yeah, that is what we are going to be doing today. And I'll give you guys a glimpse of my backyard. So, just 
that is what my backyard looks like i have artificial turf so yes it is green but that is what my backyard looks like frost so but yeah it is just so yeah we got we got snow not a lot but we got snow the roofs are covered yeah so it is gold anyway gotta figure that or my heat's gonna keep kicking on so but yeah so that's gonna do today binging on some hometown i don't know if you guys have ever seen that show before it's on hgtv but i really like that show so i'm gonna show you what we're working with today so that is laundry from my son's room it's his dirty laundry and his blankets this is my foyer we were painting and doing some work and this is my son's bathroom so it is pretty filthy the cat litter box needs to be changed he just needs a deep clean in here and then this is my son's room we're gonna get it all cleaned up and functional and we're gonna move the bed we're gonna clean the carpets so we're gonna do it all so all right let's get into it and I'll see you guys back here, okay? Bye. <laughs> Someone else, I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes, I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes, I'm gonna be myself, I'm gonna be someone else, I'm gonna be myself, I'm gonna be someone else, I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes, I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. Try not to hold me down, feel alive. This town Look at those beautiful stars I wanna drive a faster car Nothing can break me No, no, nothing can break me I 
nothing can break me We're falling out, we have reached disaster Don't know where we're gonna be after And we do it all again and again and again and again Again and again and again and again We're falling, falling down, we faded But I know, I know that we can save it Cause we're like Alpha and Omega Whatever happens doesn't matter, I know we can sort it out Alpha and Omega Even if we go a lot of breakers down, I know we are Alpha and Omega Whatever happens doesn't matter, I know we can sort it out Alpha and Omega Alpha and Omega Like the waves pull you down underwater We're fun until we hit the bottom And we do it all again and again and again and again Again and again and again and again We're falling, we're falling down, we're fading But I know, I know that we can save it Cause we're like Alpha and Omega Whatever happens doesn't matter I know we can sort it out Alpha and Omega Even if we go a lot of breakers down I know we are Alpha and Omega Whatever happens doesn't matter I know we can sort it out Alpha and Omega Alpha and Omega
same things You want a house in Malibu Are you feeling the same way I do? Are you feeling the same way I do? It was a Saturday night when I'm seeing you just dancing in the middle of the crowd. There was something about you, cause you got stuck in my mind. Stuck in my mind, stuck in my mind. I thought I'd give it a go and I started talking to you. I don't know what I said, but the next thing I knew is that I held you in my arms and you asked what we should do. What should we do? What should we do? I said you can do what you want to with me, yeah, I won't mind. As long as you stay with me, I'm alright I wanna hold ya We started walking the streets and then we stopped for a while And you said you wanna kiss me I remember thinking, is this really happening? Happening, happening I never thought I'd meet someone so beautiful I couldn't quite believe it, it was magical Just kissing on the street lights on our way back home Our way back home, our way back home I said you can do what you want to with me Yeah, I won't mind as long as you stay with me, I'm alright I wanna hold ya
everybody and welcome back to my youtube channel um thank you so much for coming by this is my first video of 2022 and i am so excited um this is going to be a calm and relaxing clean with me i want to jump into the new year just relaxed and calm and stress-free and that's what today's video is going to be about so after this intro there's not going to be any more talking it's just going to be calm relaxing music and me just cleaning my house um the purpose of today's video is just doing enough enough to just get through a couple days or get through a week or whatever it is you need um i have to stress that your house does not have to be spotless at every moment and not everything has to be perfect so sometimes just doing enough is good enough and your best and I hope that everybody out there is doing their best and just living their best possible life and remembering that not everything has to be perfect so I really hope you guys enjoy video today's video and let's get into this up my head held high no shirt no shoes but a beating heart and i made sure that my tongue was tied try to shut up and just put up with all the lies they told guess this is what it's like when you grow up i'm feeling old some say it's normal when you get formal it comes with age what a mistake because when i was a kid i dreamt of something greater like standing on a stage and hearing all those people shout my name but now i'm hanging low and looking for someone to blame so myself this time
so hard I grew up without a scar Just living my life with no big worries And I've always known what I want Just didn't know what came along Finding myself a much less happy Back in the days I used to dream about one day A life so amazing Not everyone judging me Don't wanna care about them Though it hurts so bad I wanna stay wide open Cause if I shut down It just gives them right I wanna stay Inside a way until I'm safe again I have nothing more to put on I'm defeated and withdrawn Just trying to understand where it went wrong Always believe that nothing good in life is free But it's overwhelming how people can help Oh, oh, oh.
Everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new, thank you so much for joining me. If you are returning, thank you so much for uh, coming back. So in today's video, I am so excited. So I ordered this spice jar set off of Amazon and I'm really excited to uh, put it together and see what it looks like. Um, as you can see in this video, I had my spices in my cabinet and I had bought this like cheapy set from Walmart. Um, but it just really wasn't functional, it wasn't working, and I couldn't really access a lot of the spices unless I pulled a lot out of the cabinet. So I decided to order this set off of Amazon, and it came out, I think, looking so good. Um, of course, it's probably going to be um, expanded because um, I would like to add more spices and... and experiment more um with cooking um but yeah so we're gonna we're going to rearrange some things in my kitchen get my kitchen clean get my living room my bedroom and just kind of get my house back in order today so come along with me Share a bond, no matter what Cause 
So this set came with 24 jars and different kinds of labels. Um, as you can see sitting on the table, the black labels with the white marker, you can write your own names on the spice jars. Um, they also came with some clear looking ones that were a little bit bigger. Um, I ended up using the white uh, kind of like rectangle ones you'll see in just a minute. Um, but yeah, here I'm literally just going to sit here and fill jars. I did not record the whole session because I didn't think you guys wanted to sit here for 20 minutes and watch me fill jars. But I did fill a few of them just to kind of show you what they're looking like. And then um, I will... Uh, uh, you know figure out where they're gonna go in my kitchen so yeah so we're just gonna sit here and fill some jars uh full of spices
I could have done something, but now I'm left with an empty heart. No making amends, no waking up beside you and holding you till we forget it all. How could I know there was no second chances? Like dominoes, my love got really scattered. You couldn't keep the door shut. Speak of the truth when it's tainted I fell into a big black hole It got me stone cold So I'm gonna clean up my mess and then I'm gonna experiment with um, two different drawers um, to see which one works better and which one looks better so to speak um, so yeah, here I'm just trying to figure out how the jars fit on it and if I had it sitting right so that way when I put it in the drawer, I already know how it goes. But yeah, here I'm just trying to figure out, you know, how it's going to look and I had to clean my drawers out because they were pretty messy, which is, you know, normal because I just get kind of messy when I'm cooking. But yeah, here I'm just going to try to figure this out and I will try to link these in the bottom. Um, in the description box I got them off of Amazon now when you buy the jars you do not get the tray with it and the jars do not come pre-filled my husband thought they came pre-filled and they don't so I ordered 24 jars and I think that was 20 I want to say like $26 and then the tray itself was like another because total it was like $54 I think for the jars and the little holder that they sit on um, so uh, it just so yeah, so I don't know, I guess maybe to me it just didn't seem like that much of a big cost, but I, if you wait until we get to like, I actually end up putting it in another drawer, um, the back spices are way in the back and they're kind of hard to get out. So um, for now they're going to sit in the drawer that I left them in, but I think eventually when I expand my spices, I'm going to end up putting them where my silverware drawer is. I don't know. Um, I haven't decided yet, but I did put them in number order and I do think that they came out looking um, really, really good and I will definitely do a slow motion of what they look like and the labels look cre clean and crisp and very aesthetically pleasing. I want my kitchen to be functional as well as aesthetically pleasing so it's going to be so easy for me um, to cook without having to look for stuff. Guess he clear through the smoke you created I feel my feet on the ground and they're shaking How am I supposed to save the situation? Is there a
So when you clean out one drawer and you get a domino effect and you got to clean out more. So I'm cleaning out my junk drawer because I actually end up using this as my silver, not my silver, my drawer for like my whisk and pizza cutter and all that stuff. But yeah, I'm going to clean out my junk drawer and just kind of get rid of stuff. I really not like having a junk drawer in the kitchen. I don't see the point of that. So we're going to get this all cleaned out and then I'm going to get it um, organized and ready to go and then I'm going to get the rest of my kitchen cleaned up and then we're going to um, move to the living room at the end of this video um, <coughs> or no maybe that was the last video never mind I was gonna say I'm cooking but I think that was the last video I have a goal for 2022 and that's to post at least twice a week um, to try to grow my channel more I'm hoping to hit a thousand subscribers by June and so um, I'm going to start posting to um, maybe three, depending on how everything goes, um, two to three times a week um, to try to get my videos out there to get people to see them and like them. So um, if you could share my videos and give me a thumbs up, that would be um, fantastic. And just kind of let your friends know if they're looking for like a cleaning channel. Um, my channel will be strictly just cleaning and organizing and hopefully here soon some DIYs. There are some things I wanna do to my house. We wanna paint, we wanna get new flooring. Um, you know, I want to redo my foyer in my bedroom. I'd really like to do board and batten in my bedroom, but that's going to be, you know, later, later. So, um, I hope that you guys will get a lot of motivation out of my channel and, um, yeah, so that's what we're going to do. So, um, 
it stopped recording at some point because my camera just does that. So I really need a new one, but what can you do? So I'm gonna show you everything that I got done. So I'm gonna flip you around, okay? And hold on. Okay, as you can see, I got my tea, my coffee cups, not all of them are clean. Coffee, everything up here, coffee maker, my little uh, uh, milk frother thing. So got that, so that's in that cabinet, which I think will make it so much easier in the morning when making coffee. Pass my refrigerator. It's not very full right now because I haven't gone grocery shopping, but this is gonna be snacks. So anything, so I got my chocolate ch at the mug cakes that Adam likes. Uh, those are chocolate chip uh, to make cookies. Um, and then snacks, so. And then this cabinet, which, you know what, it's kind of a mess, but you know what, that's okay because I know everything's at. So I got all my, like, I got granola, so baking stuff, because um, Adam and I do like to bake together. And then I got all my, like, rice wine vinegar, Worcestershire, soy sauce, bouillon, all that. And an open thing of syrup, because pancakes are life in this house. So, yeah. <sighs> then, you want to see the mess of my kitchen. So we got dishes, my dishwasher needs to be ran, and the giant mess I just made with Cheez-Its. So, and that needs to go up into the cabinet with the teas, but yeah. So, and then these are all my extra, um, so these are gonna be like refills for when my spice jars get empty, so yeah. And you probably saw a slow-mo of this, but that is what my spice jars are looking like. So I think I'm gonna end up ordering the bigger one because I really wanna expand my spice uh, inventory here and these keep falling and I don't know how to stop that so I don't know but for now you know what it looks really good I think a lot better than it did it'll be so easy just to open this drawer grab what I need so yeah see we got chipotle seasoning basil bay leaves cayenne Chicago which I actually had a jar called Chicago Steak Seasoning, ironically. Oh, I think I threw it away. Okay, so yeah, it was... So that was actually kind of nice to find that uh, named uh, sticker in there. And yeah, just, you know, my camera will not focus for the life of me. There we go. Paprika, smoked paprika, pepper, poultry seasoning. Yeah, so it'll be nice. Okay, so I'm going to... Uh, because I have Spotify playing, I had to pause it to talk. So I'm going to turn that back on, and then we're going to clean up this kitchen and get the rest of the house clean. So yeah, let's get into it. And only be more like them. Over and over, you cry yourself to sleep. And you are colder, much colder, if only you could see. Don't you know that you're beautiful Just the way you are
perfect as you are Just the way you are Keep on shining You're perfect as you are vacuum out my vent because it's like super messy but I don't know if anyone knows this but um about a week and a half before Christmas our entire heating and air conditioning system went out just completely went out now I live in Colorado and I when we bought the house there is a there was a heat pump and a heat pump is usually connected to your central air system and what it does is it pulls cold air from the outside heats it up and then heats up your home with it but unfortunately heat pumps are not meant to handle frigid temperatures and here in Colorado I mean the other day it got down to eight degrees and that's not even the coldest that it's ever been I mean we've been in the negatives and the heat pump was just constantly running well then we ended up running out of Freon in the air conditioning unit and the Freon that is used for my unit was banned by the EPA so we just ended up um, completely getting a whole new system and I'm going to be totally transparent with you guys. It was $11,000 and, uh, we had to put it on a credit card. And so now I am, uh, working extra hours at work and trying to save money to pay this off. Um, this is also, you know, kind of on top of eye surgery I had last year and my son got braces last year. We're still paying those off. So, um, so yeah, so, one of my big goals for 2022 is to definitely be um, paying a lot of stuff off and to um, hopefully grow my channel enough that I can start bringing in some extra income because, you know, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> that would be nice. Um, so, yeah, but um, so I just I had to vacuum out my vent because it was nasty. And here I'm just uh, making my bed and I'm um, getting my room cleaned up. And yeah. In your arms of gold. In your arms of gold. It's funny how easily a life can be torn apart. What could not simply?
Everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I've noticed I have quite a few new subscribers, so I'm just going to reintroduce myself. My name is Melinda, and I am married, have been married for um, 13 years, and I have a 12-year-old son. Um, I also work a full-time 40-hour job, as does my husband. So on today's video, this is a just a kitchen clean with me. Um, it's going to be a little bit slower, a little bit more calming, a little bit more relaxing. On this night, um, I had worked um, 8 to 4.30 and um, I had come home and I made tacos for dinner um, and then I just decided that it would be a good time to film. My husband and my son were playing video games so I thought this would be a good time to grab the camera. I am still in my work uniform if you're wondering what I'm wearing and I am cleaning the kitchen um, after we have had dinner. Um, so this is just going to be just the kitchen but it's very calming and relaxing and kind of gives you an idea of you know kind of day to day life at my house. Um, I do this quite often cleaning not long after I get home from work. Um, my schedule has changed and I am working later now. I used to work really really early in the morning like either 4 a.m. or 6 a.m. Um, but now my schedule has changed and I'm working 8 a.m. to 4 30. I do like it. Um, it's not bad. I don't have to get up as early and I can take my son to school um, but I also get off later so we're now having dinner a little bit later. Um, so yeah so I will be just cleaning up the kitchen giving my kitchen a good clean and I hope you guys enjoy this video and gives you some uh, cleaning motivation. Of all the magic places in the world I've been to, this is where my heart is. Oh, you know it's true. No matter where I go, I'm coming home to you. night I was so tired um, parts of my job are very physical I stock and I stock a lot of stuff and put back stock away and uh, do trash and so um, my day at work was uh, very physical and so when I got home I was very very tired um, but I still do enjoy cooking for my family so tacos was um, very easy. If you go back through my videos, um, there's a cook and clean with me and I show I show how I make tacos. Um, but yeah, so I just made tacos on this night and now um, I was trying very hard to get the kitchen clean. Um, I had my AirPods in and had music to kind of help motivate me. But you know, sometimes, to be honest, um, I don't always clean up the kitchen after dinner. Sometimes I'm just so tired, I just take a hot shower and go to bed. Um, but on this night, I really wanted to get it done and have my kitchen clean for the next day. So, um, yeah, that's what we're doing. I'm staring into your blue eyes. We don't need nobody else. I got you. And you got me too I've been saying
say me to you Yeah, I need it Don't you need me to Cause I got you And you got me too We, we watch the sun go down Over the same old town like so many times before we look at the same old stars battle the same old wars like so many times before and i know that we're not perfect but i'm gonna miss all that we had yeah i know that we're not perfect but i need this night for the last time You call 
everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, so today is going to be, um, I think this might end up being a one or two day clean. I'm not really sure yet. Um, I have a lot of things on my list. Um, but yeah, we're going to get, the house is somewhat clean. Um, like dishes are done. Uh, my bed is made, things uh, that of nature, things like that. But um, there's some deep cleaning I want to do. I want to get the baseboards clean. And I want to um, get, uh, sorry, I can't even think, the inside of my cabinets in my kitchen clean. Um, so, yeah, we'll see if we get to those. But, um yeah, so today we're going to get all this done. So if you need some cleaning motivation and you want to chit chat, um, hit subscribe and hit the notification bell. And yeah, we'll uh, get right in. did not end up getting as much done as I wanted to. Um, I had a lot going on personally, and so that's why I look so intense um, just cleaning. I just felt like I just needed to um, clean whatever I'm, whenever I'm feeling down or something has got me stressed out. Um, I turned to cleaning to kind of de-stress, so that's what I'm doing here. And um, But by the time I was done or got to where like the kitchen I was just too tired to clean out the cabinets and clean out the fridge so I'll probably put that in another video 
But yeah, here I'm just cleaning up my son's room. I really need to get the carpets clean in my house. They were um, really gross. And um, not only that, we're getting into a cold spell because I live in Colorado. And I wanted to get the carpets clean um, before we get cold. The fun times we had I'll never forget We will always share a bond No matter what Cause you have a piece of my heart And I know that we're not perfect But I'm gonna miss all that we had Yeah, I know that we're not perfect But I need this night For the last time like to know if um, everyone's enjoying my cleaning videos um, I had plans to do a lot of DIYs but uh, my son getting braces and me having eye surgery um, financially that just um, couldn't work out this year so but I'm hoping next year that I will try to get um, a lot of things done that I wanted to get done this year um, I hope everyone's Christmas is going good um, as you can see, I already decorated my clean and decorate is up on my YouTube channel if you haven't seen it yet, um, if you'd like to go check that out. But here I'm just cleaning up the living room and just um, getting things vacuumed and I'm going to clean the carpets in here and everything and just get everything nice and clean. Things that I said came out totally wrong Can't speak of the truth when it's tainted I fell into a big black hole It got me stone cold Hoping that you'll find your way back to me 
Quite a few new subscribers so I'm just gonna reintroduce myself my name is Melinda and I am married I've been married to my husband for a little over 13 years and I have a son and he's 12 and we live in the state of Colorado um, we bought our house three years ago and we are so excited um, you know we we love it it's a little small we do plan on um, selling it to buy a bigger one in a year or two but um, for the most part we do like it um, yeah, so if you have any questions or comments, just let me know and I'll answer them. Now that I'm looking back, I can see all the signs I tried to fill in the cracks that were spread in my mind. But I was all out of hope, lost in an endless maze. The emptiness had afforded just like a void. But you. Myself. 
off if you call it quits I'm gonna stay in this bed until you love me again If you could just listen to what I have to say A minute of your time, that's all I want Then I'm out of your way Change 